Hi, this is Paul from GlobalTradingSoftware.com and this is a futures trading tutorial but with a bit difference. The first time I've looked at soybean futures, we've just had an article written about trading soybean futures and there's a lot more volatility and volume nowadays with um, you know the, the veganism uh, wave that's, that's going across the world with all these, uh, you know, and intolerance to dairy and soy milk and all that sort of stuff. There's a soy futures seem to be very very tradable so what i've done is had a quick look uh using our expert algo and also obviously i've got the um the guardian zones on there this is this is ninja trader uh and then i've also had a quick look at the vwap predator so a couple of things really uh, with the expert algo it's designed around the haikinashi candle that's the one of the most most important things so that's uh, on our chart there's hiking ashi so <clears throat> i'm going to go through the short trade we didn't get an expert algo on this long but the vwap predator got it pretty good as well so the main thing for me right now is the fr the chart is framed so with the with the guardian zones we can see we've got a massive weekly zone down here if i just take that away you'll see it disappear with a daily zone okay so that is really strong support down here the 15 minute zones are in cyan 30 minute zones here uh, and then the the 15 minute high kanashi um, are the orange zones. so we've got some really big support and resistance zones and what we're looking for is to trade between those zones so we're looking for signals so remember we are looking for reasons not to trade so when we get this five and six star buy we don't buy into resistance we've got resistance up here um whether it's the 15 minute uh the the 30 minute it's all there it's all saying don't go in but when we come and test that and then we get a six star sell we've got to go we go short there's no, the, the Guardian Zones are saying this, this is only short term, this is just a pivot, it's not support. And it goes all the way down to this very thin, but very strong support zone. The manager is there to manage the trade. So remember, we look for that ribbon turning green and we get out at this point here. Great short trade, six star sell, highest probability move. Remember, we didn't take the longs because we're going in to resistance. We take the short because we've got lots of fresh air underneath, not just to that little zone, but also then to the weekly and the daily zones. So then we find that support starts to move back up again. Different type of movement this. Time of day is very, very important. So we go back to this one. We are talking sort of pre-market. This six star sale comes in around about the market open actually. Uh, and that takes us all the way through into the close. Then we, the next day we start to come back up again. Uh, 0130 is not tradable for everybody, but with the VWAP Predator, we can see there are ample opportunities uh, around 3 a.m., 6 a.m., 7 a.m. Then we get the big one at the open here for the long, the buy signal there, and it goes along all the way into that resistance zone, into the close for the soybean. Uh, futures closed there so it's very very tradable remember market conditions and moves are different so you need those different strategies but to me uh, if i've got i'm gonna i'm gonna i'll be playing with this a little bit but i think you know this 15 minute hike in ashi maybe 10 um i'll play with it but this looks good we're getting some good signals it's respecting uh, guardian zones so obviously institutions are trading this because there's some good strong decision points where t the price is turning and then with the what I did with the the VWAP predator is I've got it on 10 minute I wanted a slightly smaller time frame with the VWAP predator uh, but it's still giving some great signals and great moves and again we are using those guardian zones to keep us safe and more importantly with this with these longs here is to keep us out of trouble trading indicators give signals on the set amount of rules uh, the algorithm sees that are met um, it doesn't take into account institutional um, decision points this is what the guardian zones is for and uh, that keeps us out of trouble 
with it testing those coming down getting lots of fresh air we take those traits uh, so what i'm going to do is going to put the links down below in the description for uh, the x pride algo the manager the guardian zones and then that vwap predator so combined there's some great couple of different trading strategies trade management and then that important guardian zones to keep you safe hopefully that helps take a look at soybean futures that it is the future of trading there's a lot of uh, volatility a lot of movement and i think this could be uh, a retail trader's favorite in, in time to come